Hello and welcome back everyone. I am Manic Mink. This is Europe Universalis 4. When we last left off, we were in a bit of trouble. Spot of bother, if you will. Um, these are both admin tech. Uh, which I will take. Military tech I want to wait for. Visors. Exhaustion is an upkeep advisor cost. That helps. Uh, I'm going to try and max this one out first. So let's go down there since you are marching there. It's also one, two, three, four, five. Make some more. Some more infantry. And thankfully we have beaten this army it looks like. And thankfully there's another 20-something stack of Polish troops coming in, or Lithuanian troops coming in. Because, man, this war has actually taken a long time. Come on, get in there. There we go. That's a hell of a war, <laughs> Jesus. Um, hold on. You, papacy. I can't do anything with the papacy right now. Alright, so one of you go here. The other one go here, please. Just actually have everybody march here and hopefully be able to I know we can't wipe them, but it would be nice to get a decent battle in. Come on. Give me some good rolls or get me some reinforcements. Uh, war exhaustion is high. There are disloyal estates. Get rid of that. Call allies into our war. Let's do that. Stop rolling well, seriously. Stop rolling well, I need you to stop. There we go, okay. back to my territory to try and siege through it. Okay. Let's 
see, is Genoa doing something with their armies? It must be, I'm sure. Let's kill 3,000 Hungarians. Yes, we'll take that. bit and you guys have wandered even further into my territory which is bad news for you also what is this war over conquest of Maros shit no wonder I'm not getting anywhere I haven't taken Maros yet We did just siege through his capital, which is helpful. I just need to get down here to... Go and siege through Maros and then try and take this one here. Hopefully my allies can deal with the rest of this. National decisions. Yes, I will take a whole new army. That will help out quite a bit. Siege value, you don't, so you are basically useless to me as anything other than a fighting guy. Put you guys down here. quickly. Uh, do not meddle in the clergy. Okay. No, just stay where you're... No, you idiot. If you had just stayed where you, at, you were at, you could have... Seed through... Siege my land back. Damn it. Well, I mean, I guess they're helping, but still, it's kind of annoying to have to play, like, whack-a-mole here, and still they've taken Krakow, and that's annoying.
Thankfully, uh, seems like Lithuania has like an infinite number of troops here, so I'm not complaining at all. Oh, Genoa lost. Oh, that's why. 21,000 troops. Okay. Um, let's go Papal State. Get that relative strength of the alliance down. Um, you. Give me... And let me say, in all treaties with you, can I get this? Uh, so I don't have enough for more than basically one province. And all treaties with Castile, sure. For this, Let's see where we're at with manpower. Well, that was a successful war against some major powers, really. with Sweden. Genoa won't like me anymore. France still likes me. Opinion of me. So get an extra stability, I can get an extra mercantilism. I'm gonna go with mercantilism. Moldavia has rebels. Why are your rebels so high? Let's go down there then. No relationships with Genoa now. Okay, um, you know what I'll also do, I have you free, so let's go prove relations with the Papal State. So cancel that mission to improve prestige. Not gonna happen anytime soon. Mothball the forts for a while. Mm -hmm. 
15.30. I think I will take that when I get a chance. I get a von Habsburg on the throne, that'd be handy. Anything worth increasing? Not really. the money, rebel uprising. What am I, why are there orthodox zealots in here? Um, oh right, because I accidentally decreased the autonomy like an idiot. That's the problem there. Well, if they're going to... Ah, oh, it's ten years, that'll be plenty of time. I don't actually have a lot of defense along this border, do I? I'd rather put the fort there and then get rid of this one. Mission. Vassalized Teutonic Order. Love to, but literally part of the Empire can't. Venice. Let's get Venice to like us then. Surely they will. Ooh, you're at war with a lot of people, hungry. What is this war about, though? Who started it? Bohemian conquest of that. Okay. So hopefully none of it will go to the Ottomans here. So they're gonna be scary soon. I would like ideally to cut them off here, but it's a bit easier said than done. Still sort of waiting at this point, want to recover my manpower and rebuild my troops. 733, 734, so let's build a cannon there. And another cavalry. We have a chance. Come on. I like that they're actually handing all this over to Burgundy because. I don't have to worry right now about uh, hopefully this turning into Ottoman territory. Port Maros, that's great. Ten five five. Guess I could do that. Nine seven twenty two four. 
Uh, yeah, I'm going to take this because that gets me a little bit closer to my next tech level. And I'm gaining, uh, gaining well, gaining points pretty quickly. Though I'll have to take this and then... Uh, I'll take the Papal Influence right now. That's going to be the better option. Hungary being completely overrun because we did all the work. You're welcome, everyone. Two, six, Lundberg, Allied two, Sweden. So if we went to war with Sweden, I could get Teutonic Order into a war, but that means going to war with Sweden. No, I don't want to take anything that gives me extra tech cost. Thank you very much. I'd love to regain my manpower, if that's cool with you. Hey, Croatia. Revoke embargo. And I will rival Bohemia. Also, I will fabricate a claim. We are close enough at this point that I would like to catch up with tech. All right, but we'll take a break here. So I'm Manic Mink. This is European Vassalis 4, and we'll see you later. Take care.